Ooh, what is going on gunners alive coming at you with another video and today we're going to be doing a house update video we got ting dad and mom and we're gonna check on the progress of my parents new house see how it's coming along if you're new here to the channel please hit that subscribe button drop a like as well if you're returning Welcome back. Hope you're having a great day. And if you'd hit that like button also, I'd very much appreciate it. First things first though, there are some workers, some other folks around, so mask up to be safe. Now as we approach the house, this is the first time I've seen it in a couple of weeks. They got the brick on the outside, they got some stone, driveway concrete is poured, trees going in, grass going in so we'll be looking around the outside and then also walking around the inside checking out cabinets floors countertops rooms walls are you protecting yourself from the sun <laughs> <laughs> if y'all couldn't already tell it's a three car garage got a double door on the right side and a single door on the left side they already got the garage doors installed the automatic pulley systems give us an updated house tour please mom this is our new door you can't see the glass yet, it's a surprise. It's gonna be big. Oh, that's tall. Don't it is tall. And big. So okay. here's me standing. I'm six foot one and I can almost touch the top. On my tippy toes, I can touch it. All right, are we ready? Yes, we're ready. Okay. Please. Ooh, nice. Walking in the front door. All right, let's go this way. So we got the flooring down. Is this a wood or is it a tile that looks like wood? Yeah. Oh, this is nice. Alright, so the carpet. Yeah, the carpet is nice. Oh, that's 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 nice. Oh, and the tree doesn't block either of the windows. So that's nice. Mm -hmm. And let's see, in the closet, you want to see? Mm -hmm. We have to do double shelves and rods. Oh, the light works. Double shelving, light works. double rods. Ha <laughs> ha. And then I'll replace those lights with fans. Oh, Later okay. on, we'll it has all the, the all the wood in place and everything. Mm -hmm. Okay, so as my mom was saying, currently they have lights, but they'll make it fans. Got the switches over here by the door. See if it works. Oh, it does work. Turn up. Next up, after bedroom number one, we go to the exercise room. Exercise room. Mm -hmm. So I think we'll probably put the rower and the bike and the weight machine mm -hmm. and then leave a strip. But I think now I'm going to reverse it because mm -hmm. I want to be able to, or maybe we'll put the weight machine wherever he has to have room. But I want to leave a space here for my yoga mat. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. so then from the exercise room, mom and dad will be able to see out in the backyard and even see the lake behind their house. So the house is going to be four bedrooms. One master bedroom and then three other bedrooms. They'll have two bedrooms set up, like bedroom style, and then this fourth bedroom that we're in they're going to turn it into an exercise room after the exercise room there's bedroom one we're in exercise room now we'll go into the bathroom so in the bathroom we got the sink they got the counter tops they got the drawers those don't open but the bottom doors open toilet shower you can see the what is it what do they call it when you have those filler small pieces in the between accent, the tile. Accent strip. So the accent strip. This was actually wrong the first time they had it replaced because they installed the incorrect accents. So just a traditional tub shower combo in this restroom area. Mm -hmm. Nice. This is where I'm gonna put all the Snoopy decorations that are currently at our house. Yeah. This is like a not wood, right? Like a this tile wood. Tile wood, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's it's tile material to look like wood. Mm -hmm. Is that the best way to describe it? Good. I like it. It looks good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it turned out, it turn out nice. Yeah, yeah and I like how it looks I mean, long. It has some ridges to it too, y'all. Yeah. So the tucker won't slip. So behind me is the front door. I'm gonna turn the camera around and y'all can see all the way out to the backyard so down the main hall bedroom exercise room 
back windows, kitchen to the right, living room area, garage to the left, game room to the right. So walking down the hall, let's show you all the game room. There's gonna be a pool table in here eventually, but to start off, it'll be the ping pong table. Plenty of room. With a TV in here, some speakers and everything, just a little hangout area. Okay, so TV, entertainment center. There's some huge windows. And the good thing about the windows here, y'all can see they're low again. So dogs will be able to look out into the backyard and everything. Some privacy from the neighbors, because they'll be in the backyard a little bit maybe. But it's not their patio area, it's just the side of their house. The house is still being done, it's still, still messy. So they'll be touching up the paint and everything on the walls, cleaning the tile. So also in the game room, they have these doors to enter, double door. I'm not sure how often the doors will be closed, but I definitely like how they look because the glass is such a big piece. You can see through the doors easily. So walking out of the game room, you have front door, garage, another restroom area, another bedroom area, and the living room, which we'll get to in a moment, but we'll walk over to another bedroom. Oh, pardon me, this is the utility room, not a restroom, utility room. Walking into the third bedroom, and in the third bedroom, you also have a third restroom area. So, same type of shower, bathtub combo, the accents, the tile, the corner shelf. Everything looks similar. Countertops look good. Cabinets, toilets, turn off the light. And then once again, you have another window. So the window looks out to the other side of the house, the left side. You have plenty of backyard space. The neighbor's house and patio is far away. So you won't be looking directly at where they're hanging out if they're in the backyard. And I think mom and dad might put a shed in the backyard on this side at some point to start off it's not gonna happen and then also from this window you can see there's a door for the back of the garage in order to get to the backyard so if you got the lawnmower you can just take it straight out that door let's go look at it real quick so now we're walking down the hall into the garage so here is the back door access to the backyard double garage door the single garage door the backyard access door and you have a deeper left side of the garage for some more storage space and you can also store a little bit up here on the right side and then access to the house so then you get home walk in hello everybody how are you so a few moments ago i showed you all the third bedroom there's going to be a closet to the right hand side entry and then also the utility room so you'll have the washer the dryer and then mom and dad have some shelving put in. I think this shelving was supposed to be another door accessible from the hall area, but they had the prints changed a little bit so they can get the shelves in the utility room to utilize them. Put some washing materials, put some towels. So in here, yeah, washer, dryer, and uh, they'll have a fridge too. We'll have two refrigerators at the house. One in the utility room and then one in the kitchen. Okay, mom, you wanna give a little tour of the living room area? I haven't shown it yet, but we're about to walk in. Okay. Hang on, wait, wait. I'm gonna get to walk in. And then you... Hang on just a minute. Okay, mom, we are ready as we walk down the hall to the living room and kitchen area. All right, so here's our big living space. So we have our countertops, which is our pride and joy. It's called Golden Thunder. So it's got some gold accents, some black in it, some white, some tan. Petrified wood. It looks incredible. I really like the countertops. Yeah, it's nice. So we have our shelving. Nice. Darker. The island is is huge. What are the dimensions of it? Yeah, I have to tell you. Because I'm a fan of huge islands, which this is. Yeah, kind of this stuff and then you have the color scheme. What type of material is it? It's granite. granite. Good. And then you'll have some chairs looking towards the cooking area. 
hang out, do some homework for the grandkids maybe one day, do some work for mom and dad on the computers, just hang out, eat a little bit. If I come over to hang out, I can eat here, put my laptop on the table, or not the table, the island. And then is that the final water spout or are they gonna yeah, change it? So it's one of the ones where you can pull the head yeah. and then spray it. I really like that type, that's my favorite. Mm -hmm. sure. It's my favorite type because what you can do with it is you can just go ahead and turn it on like normal or you can pull off the head and you can do the different settings. So it's more of a spray, it's a single jet, you can move it around. So that makes it really useful. Yeah. So y'all already saw the island and the sink. On the right hand side, we're gonna have the range top. I believe, mom, is that a gas stove top, gas range top? Gas stove top. Gas stove top. Uh, electric. You have two ovens. Two ovens. So the microwave will go here. Nice. Oven down here. Oven down here. Oven down here. Oven here. Oven here. Oven here. Oven down here. Oven down here. Gas cooktop here. Okay. And then dishwasher. And then you got a corner pantry. Yeah, we have a corner pantry. Bigger than what I have at home, but not a walk in. Well, I guess I can. You could walk, walk in a little bit, grab some stuff. It's yeah. plenty of room. Shelving. And then, how high does it go? Oh, it's laying a little bit light. What's the light button at? In here, light, camera, action. This and then, coffee bar. Oh, yeah. this is gonna be our coffee bar. So have a coffee pot, and some cups, a little area to grab your needs. And that's gonna be Tucker and Maya's Mmm, Tucker and Maya. And Good, and rock. Good that they have the eating area next to all of these windows. Oh, I didn't know those opened up. Yeah. Oh, nice. Good. Uh, yeah. Can you access it from both sides or is a wall in between? Uh, it's just one. Nice. So then aside from the kitchen area, you know, the huge living space, you can just see how many windows there are. Big windows all look out to the backyard. Have some couches, have an entertainment center which they're having built, and then the high ceilings. I want to say the ceilings are 12 feet. And then aside from the living area and the kitchen area, you'll have like a kitchen table area. That's how big the TV is going to be. You should get a giant projector. Let's go stand in this corner. Here, record real quick. Huh? Record so we can see how big it is. Is that up? God, it's crazy. Okay. Crazy. Your mom was like, I don't want this whole wall full. That's why I went to the so. I had a mistake earlier. I said the ceilings were 12 foot. They're actually 13 foot here in the living area and 12 foot at the entry area. So 13 foot ceilings. It looks huge in here. Now walking to, you like it? Yeah. I'm happy, happy for that. I love my So let's walk out to the backyard. Through the door. Is this the final door or y'all gonna have a different one? That's the final. The we're gonna have somebody put a doggy door in A here. doggy door, okay, I was about to say. I'll have a doggy door at some point. So we're on the back patio. There's lights. Where are the speakers at? It's like that party plank was damaged. Where's the speakers at? I don't know. This box right there, they're not in yet. Oh, the speakers aren't in yet? Okay. And that's gonna be a speaker. Interesting, nice. Walking out to the back patio, a huge concrete patio. You're gonna have a table, TV mounted in the corner. And then the patio actually wraps around the back of the house. It's gonna be a bunch of grass area for the dogs running around in. Got the tree newly put in. Tree one, tree two. And then my mom just noticed on the back fence area, this wrought iron fence, there's supposed to be a gate, but there's not one. So they'll have to ask the so builder about it. So I'm gonna walk out into the yard a little bit. It's a different type of grass too. There's Bermuda grass here at this house. At the house we're currently at, the house that I'll be living in, renting from my parents, they have St. Augustine. So this backyard is huge, y'all. I think it's great. Plenty of room to do activities. Really, 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 really happy for my parents. Now these are oak trees, but I believe my mom is gonna, and my dad are gonna take the oak trees out and have some maple trees put in. So when you build the house, it comes with some shrubbery, some bushes, the grass, and the trees, standard. And then if you wanna change something out, you do it on your own afterwards with this builder specifically. Next up, walking in from the backyard. Are you trying to hide? Walking in from the backyard, kitchen, 
hall living area. Now we're going to the master bedroom. The closet on the left side. Walking into the master bedroom, you see triple window. You have the wall where the bed will be looking towards the TV on this wall. And then if y'all remember from the first house video, we had wrote some sayings on the walls on the framing of the house. So one of the sayings that I wrote was up in this portion above the bed area. It said something like, good night, sleep tight. But the flooring in this room and some of the other rooms will be carpet. You see the tile that looks like wood and the other portions, but this section of the room will be carpet. You have one sinking countertop and a second sinking countertop. A bathtub with a window that you cannot see through. Clearly, the window is so that people can't see you like naked in the restroom, but it does allow a little bit of natural light in. And then on the far side, you have the shower. I'll give my mom's attention in just a second. Okay, so here's the shower. Okay. So it's big, you walk in. I can walk all, I can do that in the shower. Is there gonna be any blockage or the, just yes, the walk in, that's it? Okay, so water will stay in. Water will stay in. You have a different accent pattern in here. Yeah, it's this more. Was Daddy's favorite. I like it. I love those. I it's pretty this colorful. In the kitchen, but we couldn't do it in the kitchen. We did it in here. And then you have one shower. Do you have one shower or two shower heads? One. One. Yeah, I thought about two, but you just yeah. got one. I wasn't gonna spend two thousand dollars more. So. Okay. The one then we got rain glass. The rain glass. That's what it's called. So it lets the light in, but you can't see through it. Your daddy's toilet. It's, it's a, a narrow it's a restroom. A, I know, it's an ADA toilet, so it's two inches, it's taller. Two inches taller? So when he's old, he can still get up. Yeah. <laughs> put, up put some handles on the wall for both of y'all. Mm -hmm. Show us the closet too. Y'all right. will share a closet now, because at the house yeah. now, y'all each have your own individual closets that are a little smaller, but this has a huge walk-in yeah. closet uh, for both of y'all. Do, do, so do, 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 do. that we'll share, and then we have extra shelves put in. Um, the, that's all our whole alarm box and everything. I like the light. It's just the long, different type of bowl, bright. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So which side are you gonna have? Which side is Daddy gonna have? I'll let Daddy decide. I'm easy. I have fewer clothes. Like my clothes will probably take up like this one thing, mm -hmm. and his will take up the other. Are you gonna have dress? Are you gonna have dressers in the restaurant or in the bedroom too? I'm with we clothes are, in it? We're gonna decide, we might put one or two of the dressers in here. Mm -hmm. Like we might put the long dresser right here. To add some then, more shelves and yeah, just, drawers. Yeah, just to have it in here so I don't have to go in and out to get my clothes. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah. Sounds we'll good. See. And there's gonna be carpet in here? Yep. I'm gonna walk out to the backyard again because it looks like dad is doing some stuff and I wanna walk to the other side to show y'all on video just how big it is. So along the backyard area, we have some bushes, some dirt, I think this is monkey grass on the inside and then on the outside you also have some bushes, a walking path, and the lake. So this is a good area I feel like back here because mom and dad will be able to take Tucker out there some so he can walk around and explore and then he'll have the huge backyard which he can check out and explore too. What are you measuring for dad? Okay so dad is checking, checking the trees. This tree he's seen if it's in the right spot. The other tree apparently is in the wrong spot because he has the trees measured out how he wants them put in order to create the most shade, best shade for the backyard and the patio and everything. Yeah, so I won't have to shade here to sit by the lake. Plan that he wants to be able to sit here with shade from the tree so he can sit by the lake in the afternoon because the sun will rise in the east and set in the west. And then they're finishing up the fence also. The houses behind are I know this house is new. I don't know how long that house has been built. And then the neighbor on the other side, the house has been there for a little while. But this backyard is huge. And even the inside of the house looks huge. I said earlier, but I'm happy for my parents to get this house. Okay, we're meeting the neighbor's dog now. Hello, puppy. Hello, how are you? So pretty much that's a wrap. The house behind me, mom, dad, fiance, me gonna roll out and we'll check on it again soon next yep. next nice update day. video might be good job the the move-in video or maybe I'll do one before that we'll, we'll see what goes down but anyways if you enjoyed the video and you're not already subscribed to the channel please hit that subscribe button drop a like if you're returning welcome back she's laughing at me it's all good though 
I'm good as alive. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in a live stream or a video soon.